So I'm a man who wakes up and finds his black handkerchief, one of his two, now the second one, gone. And an employee from a company who arrives early walks out of the store to pick up her morning food and she has a black handkerchief in her hair. What should I presume, that it's a coincidence? Or should I presume that she's a part of the people who think they have rights to steal from a homeless man? You see, if I fall asleep finally after staying up really late until 2, 3, 4 in the morning, and then I sleep for a few hours before I go in and I buy my breakfast like I do every morning, do I not have the right to not be pilfered from? Do I not have the right to be myself anywhere in this world? Or is American white bread and American black bread the only people who get to live because they have jobs today? Well, maybe I have a job, but my job doesn't look like yours. And maybe I lost my life because of liars and thieves like what appear to be happening to me, not at all what is absolutely happening to me. And maybe I had a life before siblings destroyed my life with their lies and their feelings they had rights to me. And maybe I had a life and I had a face that wasn't bloody before my brother played into a community and literally drove past me 10, 20 times without ever helping me. So please, don't tell me what my life is. You can't provide your life cycle to anyone. You can't provide your life force to anyone. That's a lie you tell yourself. But if you're thinking that if you pay something, you get to take something, you're lying to yourself. At no time is Jesus Christ ever exonerated or honored by your behavior when you think you have rights to someone else's life, loins, records, documents, whatever you want to call it, motherfuckers, possessions or property.